What's up guys, Austin Dunham back again with another video. Are you looking for a dip exercise that you can do at home? Well stay tuned and I'll show you my top five dip exercise that you can do right now. All right guys, so the first exercise, um, you wanna find something with an angle just like this somewhere in your home. Usually countertops have it. So I'm in my kitchen right now, and as you can tell, we have a lot of these like angled counters. So once you find an angled counter, this is all you have to do. Hop on just like this and perform your dip exercise. All right, the next exercise simply involves getting a chair out of your kitchen or out of your room or whatever. And we're gonna be doing um, these dips called elbow dips. So you scoot the chair back, extend your legs all the way out, and do dips like such. Beginners, it's easier if you keep your legs in. That's the easier version. And then you can pro progress it and uh, pull your legs out all the way, just like I'm doing here, and doing dips like this. All right, the next exercise to do at home involves actually using your couch or some type of straight edge. So the best example I could find is definitely using a couch right here. And what we're going to be doing are front dips. Front dips are performed just like this, and then straight down, back up. Straight down, back up. All right, the next exercise I have is called the random object parallel dips. It's because here, what you need to do is look in your house and find two objects that are parallel to each other. So right here, I have a bed post, and right here, I have a dresser. So that being said, that we can actually use these as dip bars and perform dips on it. So just like this, you might have to start on your knees because it might be really low. Then you just press up to a dip, go down. All right, the last dip exercise you can do at home actually involves one of my favorite home uh, equipment gear, and that is the Ultimate Body Press Dip Stand. Now, I always keep this at home because it's, like I said, it's one of my top home gear, and all you do is, it's a dip stand, so you can pretty much take this anywhere. And before I actually had this piece of equipment, I would do pretty much all those other exercises that I showed you guys. So everybody, at the end of the day, it's up to you to be unique and creative with your workouts, but I actually hope this video helped you when it comes to learning how to do dip exercises at home. So if you enjoyed this video, please give a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe for future videos. Also, if you wanna take your gains to the next level, please be sure to visit my website, workout80.com, and I'll see you guys soon. Peace.